Hey, Tim Crow here with the Alabama Cooperative Extension. Uh, just out in the landscape today, uh, looking in some of our, our turf grasses just to kind of see what uh, uh, what weed issues uh, we're dealing with right now. Um, hopefully everybody got a uh, spring pre-emergent put out late February, uh, 1st of March. Uh, and, and you're sitting in pretty good shape as far as our warm season turf grasses. Uh, go most of uh, what's kind of playing out right now is cool season weeds that germinated back in the fall, uh, kind of early winter, and uh, they're kind of playing out. The the heat's going to drive those out whether we do anything or not. Uh, so we've kind of turned our attention away from those weeds and towards the warm season weeds that are that are starting to pop up now. Uh, and our main target weed uh, most of the time here in the south for warm season turf grasses such as Bermuda grass. Or zoysia or centipede uh, we're usually targeting crabgrass okay crabgrass usually uh, germinates when soil temperatures get into that 55 to 60 degree range which we are there um, I'm seeing some some crabgrass popping up in uh, shrub beds out into turf grasses uh, all those different areas so uh, we, have, we have hit that hit that soil range and, and so if we didn't have a pre-emergent out um, we're about to have a lot of crabgrass on our hands. Now crabgrass, they, uh, it's a warm season annual weed. Um, so what's popping up now is from seeds from last year uh, that played out uh, in early fall when, uh, when we got a frost and it, it dropped those seeds and, and they laid there and overwintered and now they're starting to germinate. Uh, and again, that's why pre-emergents are, are, are so important um, to help prevent uh, situations from getting too out of hand uh, in our warm season uh, turf grasses. Now some good options for that, uh, pendomethylene products, uh, prodiamine products, uh, dimension, um, all three are very good at uh, controlling crabgrass and they also have a big uh, or a large um, broadleaf label as far as weeds as they control as well. So good options for preventative control. Um, if we do have some crabgrass like, uh, like that I've got here, we've got uh, starting to see some small seedlings uh, pop up and this is where we want to this is the, about the size that we want to attack crabgrass um, If we've got it in our in our landscape once it gets a little bit larger than that It really gets hard to control from a herbicide standpoint um, So some post emergence that we can use if we do have some uh, would be Celsius um, It's made by Bayer Chemicals very good product as far as controlling crabgrass and then um, herbicides that contain quinclorac uh, both of those are good uh, post-emergent options if we have to uh, spray some some crabgrass out of our warm season turf grasses. Again, pr uh, preventative controls, pendomethylene, prodiamine, dimension, all three good uh, pre-emergents. Uh, Quinclorac products as well as Celsius are good post-emergent options. Now, if you have any questions, you can also uh, always contact uh, your local extension office or you can visit our website at aces.edu.